welcome to our keys world first of all thank you so much for being here i appreciate your love and support so much so first of all if this is your first video that you came across to um on my channel that's about my ceramic braces journey i do have a few update videos um i'll link the playlist down in the description box below but i have been getting a few questions on how i do my braces routine how i keep them so white um i'm just gonna be honest with you guys i use like the whitening um toothpaste and the mouthwash um i'm just gonna do a quick tutorial on what i do for my braces routine um every morning and every night it's always hit and miss sometimes i don't get the chance to do it in the morning but for sure i do it at night and i'll show you which products i use and then yeah if you guys have any other questions that you have for me just put it down in the comment section below and i will answer to the best of my abilities okay i know i said i was going to tell you guys what i usually use but when i went to go purchase more of the products that i normally use they didn't have any so this is what i have so far um the toothbrush i just used my ortho toothbrush that he gave me it has like a little dip in the middle um and then i do use crest 3d white this one is the deep clean but um i will put a picture of which one i usually use i think it's like whitening or something like that um something blast i don't know i'll find it and i'll put it in the description box below also and then for the um the mouthwash again they didn't have the ones that i usually use but for now i'm using the 3d crest um diamond strong alcohol free with fluoride um the reason why i do use crest 3d white this is not sponsored at all or anything <laughs> but um I did use their 3D Crest white strips when I didn't have my braces on and I actually like them. I used them once and it really helped me. Um, if, obviously if you use them like regularly how you're supposed to do, um, it'll get it even more whiter. But I got a lot of compliments when I did use them. They're like, how do you whiten your teeth? I'm like, I don't. <laughs> but um, like I said, I did use those white strips and it worked good. It's obviously working good for my braces. Oh, and then the last thing I forgot to tell you guys that I use is the Water Pick Water Flosser. Now, this is, I think, the waterproof one, so I think it's like the $89 one, but they have a cheaper one that's like 40 bucks, and I think that'll work just fine. I just like this because I can take it in the shower, and it's um, wireless, and it's battery, um, but you can recharge it. Um, it just has a few more features than, obviously, the $40 one. So, um, I do still floss my teeth um but i only do that once a week where i actually take the floss and go in just because it's so much tedious work and it takes forever this has been doing me good doing me um just fine so i'd use this as like a daily thing and then for sure i'll go in at least once a week with the actual floss so yeah now a little disclaimer um i do get my bands changed every five to six weeks so my appointments aren't usually four weeks like people how people usually have um follow-up appointments so by the time the fourth and fifth week come along they are starting to get a little yellow but i still get a lot of compliments that i've been able to keep them white for so long and this is the reason why when you do eat like colored foods like for example thai food or red drinks um i make sure that i rinse my mouth at least if i can't get to brushing my teeth i rinse my mouth after so that at least gets like all the acidity and stuff like that off of the braces and off my teeth um now even without braces you should still be doing this but anything colored um if i do drink a colored drink I try to drink from a straw and not just regular from a cup. Um, those are just a few tips that I've thought that helped me. And obviously it's working because my braces are still pretty clean and white and not as yellow. Um, and one more main thing is the brand of your bracket. When I asked my orthodontist, he said that he pays a little bit more for the better brand. Um, I mean, it's like every other thing, like if you get a cheap white shirt from Ross, the stitching is off, but if you get an expensive one from like Zara, like, or whatever, Macy's like a $30 white t-shirt, it's going to be better quality. So that's what it is. Um, and I feel like that plays a really big factor. So 
with all of that being said let me quickly show you guys what i do and then um yeah we'll be on our way <laughs> Okay, so how I start my routine is I take my 3D Crest toothpaste, I put it on my ortho toothbrush, and then I start with my top teeth in the front. I work my way back, and then I go to the other side, and then I obviously do my bottom teeth. Now, as you can tell, I'm doing like circular motions. Um, you want to make sure that you do circular motions on top of your bracket, in front of your bracket, and then the bottom of your bracket. Just make sure that you try to work one to two brackets each time to make sure that you get each little bracket and then work my way to the bottom when i do go to the bottom i add more toothpaste just because i feel like i need more toothpaste obviously that's optional for you but that's what i do and then when i'm done i just gargle with regular water and then i take warm water into my water pick flosser and then as you can see i showed you a little example because it gets a little messy if you don't close your mouth while you use this. So when you take the water pick, you go in between each gum, in between each tooth also, and then you point it down and then you work your way around each tooth in between the gum and your tooth. Just to make sure that you get everything that your toothbrush didn't get, you wanna make sure that um, you get in between your gums and your tooth. Then you work your way around all your tooth in the front and then I also do the back of my tooth and then I go to the bottom of my teeth. And then if you can tell, I graze it on top of my bracket and then the bottom of my brackets both on the top and the bottom. I hope that makes sense. Then when I'm done with my water pick, I just take half a cup full of the mouthwash and then I kind of dilute it a little bit because it's too strong for me with water and then I just gargle it for about 30 seconds and then at the end I'll just rinse my mouth and then gargle the back of my throat and that is it <laughs> don't you love like breathing in air when you have like that minty fresh taste in your mouth so anyways that is it for my braces routine like I said um sometimes I always don't do that in the morning but I always rinse my mouth gargle my mouth out with water um to get any of that like acidity out of my teeth out of my braces out of my brackets or anything like that um I don't always hit my teeth with floss um because I have that water flosser um but for sure I'll try to do it every like once a week twice a week just so I for sure can make sure that I do get all that in um the water flosser is recommended by a dentist, so I feel like that's okay. But sometimes, like, when I eat steak or something, I really want to get in there and take that um, <laughs> meat out. But anyway, so yeah, if you guys have any questions, please put them down in the comment section below. And if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button down there. Tap the bell button to be notified every time I post a new video. And I'll see you guys next time on Eric's World. Bye!